Middle Tennessee Electric Membership Corporation in 2015 inquired about purchasing Murfreesboro Electric Department, which is owned by the city of Murfreesboro. The Murfreesboro City Council hired GAI Engineering Firm to find out the value of MED. The Murfreesboro City Council and the MED Power Board conducted a joint meeting to hear from the engineering firm about their findings. The determination was that it was worth between $175.5 and $247.3 million, though the tendency was to lean towards the higher end because of the intrinsic value. After the determination of worth, the City Council and Power Board spoke on how to proceed. There was the opportunity for me to say, no, I don't even want to consider this because I know that the flack that I've taken over it, that, but I made the decision when I was elected to this position that I said, if offers come or things like that, I'm not a dictator. I'm going to send it to the whole city council and that they can make the decision that it's going to be open, it's going to be transparent. So I don't think it's any secret for me sitting on the power board. I think there are huge operational inefficiencies that we have to look at within the power board. I think there are things that, and this is just, I'm speaking as, as the mayor, that I think there are things and opportunities that we have to look at. but. I think where we stand right now, and what I've seen with what the asset of MED is, you know, I, I'm not leaning towards pursuing any further, uh, at least spending any more money to determine evaluation. What do you see as uh, as a council, as a process, because the board has not voted that we even want to sell, and is there going to be a referendum? And so, um, so it's a lot of unknowns about that, but. Um, I think that it's it's this has been good. I do appreciate the study and know a, a range of what we were worth, <laughs> but uh, but I think it's more personally. I think we also need to look at it purely from the perspective of is is this something we really want to sell? Because it, I think we have a true asset that's more valuable than any dollar number that we're looking at here. So I hope we keep that in mind as we continue to go through this step. I like the fact that as a, as a MED customer, I pay for what happens in, in, in my city, in Murfreesboro, where I live and where we have our business. So I, I think, you know, obviously I would like to see it stay under the control of the city. Um, but I also understand that that's not solely my decision. So, to me, the deal ma is made on intangibles and the intrinsic value that we see of the utility. Uh, appreciate the study, uh, and it is good to have some an independent evaluation of where we are as a utility. I'm a little tentative to move to to go to additional information because I'm not sure that's going to make the that's going to clarify the issue for us as to whether to move forward or not. Whatever the council's decision is, I think uh, my opinion as a member of the utility board is I think that decision is uh, less about uh, Middle Tennessee Electric and more about um, what's right for um, the city taxpayers um, and MBD ratepayers. So. Since it was just an informational meeting, the city council wasn't able to vote on how to proceed during the joint meeting. So later that night at the city council meeting, the subject was brought up under other business. Any other business to come before the city council? Mayor, I would like for the council to entertain a motion tonight uh, that we bring to a close the study to determine the appraised value of the Murfreesboro Electric Department. Second. Um, motion is second. Any discussion? Ms. Wright, we'll call the roll. Ms. Kels Harris. Aye. Mr. LaLance. Aye. Mr. Shacklett. Aye. Mr. Smotherman. Aye. Mr. Washington. Abstain. Vice Mayor Young. Aye. Mayor McFarland. Aye. 